melee, so I'm a little rusty. He got me. Okay, I'm rusty. Okay. Here. See that? That bitch was hauling ass. A good morning, fellow gaming nerds. Welcome to the Whiplash Hell channel. Uh, today we got us another episode of Survive the Nights. This is season two, episode number 29. Um, we're over here at the airport. Um, I wanted to try to have a little bit of fun. I know I ain't put out any episodes this week of Survive the Night, so um, let's see what kind of damage we can do today. I got a couple ideas of what we're going to do. I'm just not sure if it's going to work. So, without further ado, let's get in here. Oh, hang on a minute. Let's see. We need to pick up the generator. We need a pull start. Uh, I can't take the generator. I'm too freaking heavy. I gotta get rid of something. Um, planks are all like, let's get rid of these nails, maybe. Jerry can move the jerry can? Not enough yet? No, I think we need 40 pounds, right? Oh, let's get rid of the scrap metal. I forgot I had this in here. We're gonna need that jerry can, right? I had an extra one in here. I picked up one the other day. I've been doing quite a bit of work, guys. If you haven't noticed, um, let's escape out of this. I've got a bunch of uh, timber here. Uh, we're going to try to make some spikes somewhere along the way. Um, alternator. I don't think we need that. We just need... Here, let's just do a search. Be easier, right? Okay, we have just enough on us okay all right i think we got everything we need so let's get busy i'm wondering if i should go ahead uh and just use this for the time being save on the ammo uh we can't get in here without electricity so that's our goal we want to get in here and go over here and get the electricity going i haven't used melee so i'm, I'm a little rusty he got me okay i'm rusty Okay. Whew. I'm a little shy on ammo. Um, unless I decide to pull some ammo out of my ass, we might be hurting tonight. I'm trying to find a good spot. Uh, here to have a horde. Because we are on horde number three. Horde three arriving tonight. We are level five. Um, is this anything? Oh, maybe it's just lights. Uh, I was going to go ahead and place a generator here and fill it up full of gas. And um, I was kind of wondering, I remembered, I've only been to the airport a few times. <coughs> and I remembered that this was fenced in. There's probably some zombies here. So we've got an open area here. Oh, I guess we got more open areas here than I thought. Two. Three. Can we climb this ladder? It's a bit rough. I don't think we can get up that. Oh, you know what I don't think I have? I don't think I have an extension cord. I forgot all about it. Oh, man. I made all these plans, guys. Yeah. I bet I got one out in the car. Let's go ahead and place the generator down. That way it's there, and we can get rid of the weight. Where is it at? Just do this. Come on, search. We can at least go ahead and do this. Ground below is too steep. Okay, let's go out here. And try this one more time. Okay. See if we can put it in here now. Put it right there. All right. Now I'm gonna leave this here, so if anybody wants to use it, feel free to do so. Um, move, move, and move. Let's go ahead and put some gas in it. I'm gonna fill her up. 
I'm not going to start it just yet, but I am going to go ahead and fill it up. I want to try to figure out uh, a few things. Let's. We got to have an extension cord, and we got to have circuit breakers. Oh my God, we might have to make a trip home. I don't have circuit breakers. Darn a damn luck. Why don't I think of these things? Darn a luck. What is this? Afternoon already. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to be able to do this. I switched my server back to one hour days because the two hour days were just entirely too long for a whiplash. I don't have the time in my personal life to do that uh, whenever I make one of these episodes. So, uh, damn it, why didn't I think of this? Um, Dagon, I guess I could steal them from home. Home's not that far away. So that's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna run back to the house. Time wasted. Oh my gosh. At least I've already ate. I had barely enough food, so. The next few episodes, I don't know how I'm going to do them because um, I, I might end up running away from the horde these time, this time around. Not tonight, but um, the next time because I need food. I'm like totally out of everything. So we're going to have to start scavenging the houses again. And uh, killing as many zombies, getting as much food and ammo because I'm low on ammo as well. Can't believe I forgot this, guys. Can't believe I forgot it. I'm gonna go ahead and cut out of this, and I'll come back. All right. All right, guys, we're back. I can't believe I'm still kicking myself in the ass. Still kicking myself in the ass. All right. Well, at least I had them at home, and we got it now, so we're gonna get everything in order. What I wanted to try to do out here was set up these uh, spiked. Uh, barricades and see how they do now I'm just making the cheaper ones so they probably won't last long so I would like to see whether or not I can get up on top of this building um, not really sure how we can do this I mean because it looks like you can climb that ladder but it doesn't it doesn't uh... so where's the zombie every time we walk right through there there's a oh look there's a workbench I would have known that I wouldn't have made a small workbench okay so let's fill this sucker up right um, electric meter move oh we already have three circuit breakers in there so I guess that saves me for later <laughs> uh, I'm not gonna turn it on just yet all right now what I have Let's see if we can make the spike barricade here. If we can, then I might save save my small workbench for later. No, because see, this you have to have a workbench small. Timber 8, where it looks like I can make it. I tell you what, let's turn this on long enough to open up that gate out there. Turn this on. Turn this on. Okay, we're all on. I'm going to open up that gate and drive my truck in. This is probably a bad idea because if that gate closes and I don't have the necessity uh, fuel, then we're kind of screwed. This is a big, wide open field. Ain't nothing to hide behind. Um, you could jump up on these airplanes. I've tried, I've stayed up here at night, but those zombies can get up on those airplanes. So I'm wondering if I'm missing anywhere else, something else I've got to turn on. So. Ooh, is that food? Yeah, cupcakes. I've got enough food for today. We're good till tomorrow. Uh, how we open up this damn gate? I thought it might be from the inside. 
mean, we do have power. We got electricity. See that? Oh, there it is. <laughs> all right. So all my timbers in the truck here. Uh oh. I'm gonna say it should start pretty well, or pretty good. Um, I cut down three trees and made two boxes of nails. Uh oh. And er, three trees and those two boxes of nails should make me twelve barricades. Oh heck with it. I wanted an easy out, but I don't look like it's gonna be easy no matter how we do this. So we'll just park the truck right here. Okay, let's go ahead and grab some of this timber. Uh we're gonna have to do it this way. Alright, that's enough. Let's go in here and turn this generator off and then see about making some of these barricades. Now, I've never made them before. Where's this zombie at? Tell me, there's a zombie. Why's that puttering for? That's strange. Okay, let's see if we can make this spike barricade right here. Uh... Because it says that you can make it, you need the small workbench. So I guess the big workbench trumps the small workbench. Okay, with that in mind, I am going to go ahead and put the small workbench in here to get rid of it for weight. I'm assuming it weighs probably pretty good. I didn't look, but I'm just making an assumption. Uh, circuit breakers, we can move those. Yeah, 14 and a half pounds. We'll move that. That'll free up some weight. Okay, since we can make that up here, I'm, I'm not going to worry about it. All right, let's make one. And... See how to place it. See how it works. Now, to be honest with you, I wanted to barricade myself in here. But it looks like we got quite a few open spots. And I'm kind of questioning whether or not... I shouldn't even do this. I should have enough to make 12. Place. Okay. Actually, looks pretty darn cool. I would imagine they'd be able to break through this pretty quick. There's two different uh, spikes that you can make. So there's one. Uh... I'm going to be doing a lot of running back and forth. I should have parked it up there. I always park my truck too far away. It's funny, too, because um, when I was doing all that... I, I got too much weight on me. When I was cutting down all those trees and doing all that, um, every time I would cut down a tree, it ended up flying about, I don't know, it seemed like a whole mile away. <laughs> it was funny. All right, I know this is probably the last thing you guys want to see, but I should have enough wood to make 12. So we started here. Can you make repairs to this, or can you pick it up? Hold the place, press E. Oh, so you can, it's only two pounds. I thought it would be heavier than that. I got a feeling that uh, <laughs> I'm going to end up running. Scared. Damn. Or they're going to be able to get through. Ouch! Or I'm going to end up killing myself. I would imagine that if they pile up enough, they're going to be able to get through. <coughs> I still would like to see whether or not I can make it up this. I'm not sure how I can get up there. It's strange because you, 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 you're... 
when you jump up this, it automatically starts pushing you back down. Now, I don't think I'm going to be able to get up there. It would definitely, if the zombies get in, it would take entirely too much time trying to get up that. They would be beating the shit out of me. Um, before I even got to the top. So is there anything else I can offload to get some extra weight? I guess I can move these nails in here. Um, the planks. Oh, I'm totally full. <laughs> oh, not nails. I don't want the nails. Take it till I can't take no more. I guess we're gonna have to make one at a time. I don't even know if I got enough time to finish this. Evening doesn't last very long. So I got a feeling I might end up running scared tonight. We're gonna try like hell to get this done. Uh, why can't I make it? Oh, I need the nails. <laughs> oh, I'm such a dork. Oh. Yep, that's whiplash for you. That is whiplash. For some reason, I didn't think we needed the nails. I don't know why. But I can't handle any more weight now. Let's see, get rid of the scrap metal. That'll help. I thought I got rid of all that a minute ago. Campfire grill, that would help. With weight. Oh, I don't think I'm going to get this done. Should we try to take the horde on barefoot? I'm tempted. I just don't think I got enough time to do all this, especially running back and forth. Maybe I should move the car back up. <laughs> okay, so where are we at? Uh, place there and there. Place here. Another spot there. I place that one on the inside. Yeah, I don't think I've got enough time to do this. Even if I move the truck up here, it ain't going to make no damn difference. We could take, uh, do a tactic that I sometimes do um, in seven days to die. We could try it. I call it the chicken run. And see how it goes. I'm not sure to go very well. But at least you can see what I'm trying to do. We're fenced in. It's some kind of barricade. I just don't know how long those spikes will last before they break through. I just hope I don't block myself in. Of course, we can pick them up. That's, that's cool to know. I did not know that. Um, I should have enough to make 12 of these guys, like I said. may not be enough we go ahead and make another one yes we can I don't know how much wood I was able to pick up all right that's it we'll have to get more wood all right I'm gonna place this one on the inside oh oh get away no I did that on accident uh Okay. Yeah. I'll just try and do um, maybe some more of this off camera. That's kind of a strange spot to put it in. And we got another spot here. Gosh, I don't even know if I've got enough. Probably going to have to do some more wood trimming uh, let's see what time it is yeah 
I'll place a couple more and I think we're gonna try the trick chicken run method I'm not sure if this will work honestly if I wouldn't have made my mistake um, I forget the circuit breakers I probably could have got this done if not we're gonna have to try it some other time So we got plenty of open space to try the trick and run method. Um, like I said, I don't know if it'll work, but I guess we're gonna place these three and then get ready for that. I'm not sure this will work. It's pretty darn cool looking, but I'm not sure it's gonna work. My ideal here anyway yeah it's getting to be that time guys so let's go ahead and prep for that yeah Ooh, I'm nervous now shaking in my boots come on don't fail me now girl we gotta gas you up real good okay I got a gas can in here, right? Okay, chicken run method. So what exactly is the chicken run method? Well, we run around all night on our bike and lights. Of course, this ain't a bike. This is a truck. So what it is, is we run around all night on this and hop out now and again and uh, pop a cap in everybody's ass and then jump back in and run. <laughs> we got a nice big runway right here, right? And see them spawning in. I don't know if this is going to run. I don't know if it's going to work. Well, they definitely can't run as fast as the truck. So we're not gonna we're not gonna stop. Oh, that's that's a big hole. We'll have to remember that. But the way they're spawning in, I don't know how well we're gonna be able to do this. That's a lot of zombies spawning in, and it seems like they're spawning in left and freaking right. Okay, and you don't want to hit the zombies because they will, gosh, I, I can't even pick a spot to to stop and get out. Because when you get out, you got to switch to your weapon really quick. Come on, stop. I don't want the axe. I don't want the axe. What do you mean no weapons? Give me my shotgun. Pop a cap in their ass. Hmm. Well, come on. This I'll start shooting this. That'll attract some attention, right? What is this? When's the horde gonna come? I'm gonna leave that running. That way we don't have to start. We just have to hop in and start going. Now it doesn't mean they won't hit you because they can't hit you inside the vehicle. Oh God, this is stupid. What am I doing? This is stupid. I'm gonna die. If anything, this damn reload on this shotgun is gonna get me. Let's switch to the other one. I don't have many whippetry on this one. I guess we'll just run ourselves out. Why are they not coming? Arriving tonight. We are still at level 5.
What I'm worried about with the horde is they seem the horde seems to run faster than the rest of them. Oh god, that scared the piss out of me. I wasn't expecting them both to take off at me. I mean it's fine. Oh, this is stupid. Chicken run at the airport. Chicken run at the airport. I'll probably end up dying tonight, guys. I'll end up starting all over. Is it me or are these guys um, actually look like they're um, the hunchback of Notre Dame? What's going on with the... Looks like they got a crick in their net. Like they slept on it wrong. Uh, fleeing a horde has no consequence. Flee and prepare for the next night. Okay, that's fine. Approaching from the north. Okay, now this place... Now, hang on a minute. In most of the uh, airport fenced in... So I'm beginning to wonder if they can even get in. Or are they spawning probably inside of here. Okay, we're on foot, so where is the north? Okay, uh, that would be this way, right? So they should be coming from here, correct? Should be coming from that way. Oh, I'm nervous, guys. I am nervous. We are going to try that airport thing. We are going to try that. I, I really would like to see how the spikes hold up. They should be here any minute. Any second. This is difficulty level three. Okay. Where are they at? Running gun, running gun. Out in the middle of a field, guys. More or less. I ain't got much ammo left of this one. Uh, I was actually expecting them to be like more congregated, like clustered. Clustered, they're harder to kill. One on one's not too bad. Okay, we just leveled up. Uh, horde difficulty has increased to level four. So is that it? The horde's over. Ah, okay. Well, dang. For some reason, I, I thought it would be more. Now, the first time, the first horde I went to, or went, had, uh, we did it at the maintenance buildings, right? And with all the zombies that were around the maintenance building, I had a lot of them clustered. And... I thought they were part of the horde when really they must have been part of the maintenance building because when I did whiplash slide which is the second horde um, it didn't seem to it didn't seem to be as bad so really take facing them one-on-one -on -one like this is not really that bad now I don't know how you know the difficulty goes up every time so I don't know how difficult what difficulty they mean like, is, are they going to be harder to kill? Or are they faster? Or are we going to have more quantity? Like, more at a time rather than one at a time like we just had. Well, that wasn't so bad. We made it through. Really, I have, I've had a worse of time. Uh, over at the maintenance sheds. And even here at the airport, you guys want to try going in the airport? I think it's a huge mistake, but we could try it. 
going inside the freaking airport enough to whoa go 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 when you hear him running at you in the car you just might as well go ahead and run oh ho, 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 ho. okay stop 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 now see this is where you can get run into some trouble looks like my light ran out No, I guess it automatically goes out when you're getting a vehicle. I guess so because the vehicle lights are on. Okay, we got four more left. We're gonna have to switch. See this right here, that right there, that's what gets you in this game. Having having so many at one time. Okay, I kind of like this. I like this free roaming stuff. I I I do that in my seven days to die when I play. Of course, I'm probably sucked so bad at that right now. I, I'm not afraid to even play the game. I haven't played it in so long, like three, four months. I've tried, but I end up doing something else with Jaws of Extinction, Survive the Nights, and I just started that Road to Eden. Uh, <clears throat> let's go ahead and run down through here. Uh, we've only got uh, well, what's in our clip? I'm gonna leave that running. It's probably a waste of gas, but believe it or not, there's a gas station right around the corner. Come on, guys. After we take care of these, we might run over there to the airport or the warehouse or the main building there. Okay, running out of bullets. That's it, switch. Switch! Switch! Yeah. Get ahead of them, then turn around. Yeah. That's what I thought. Witchy woman. Okay, let's go ahead and grab the vehicle. And we'll go over here this way. It's almost morning. Excuse me, coming through. Oh my gosh, there's a bunch out here. Oh man. See, this this is the bad part right here. See all these guys? We'll leave the truck running. We'll call I like I said, I call this a chicken run method. At least you got somewhere you can go and take off. Oh, come on. Run and gun, run and gun. See this running and gunning? This is what's going to kill me. Whoa! She took a hit. Oh, crap. I thought I was ready. Die, gun you. All right. <laughs> See this this game is so beautiful at night. I love it. Love it. I thought I heard something. I actually sat up on top of this cotton picking airplane one night and it works for the most part, but these zombies can get up here too. Just letting you know. See? I honestly kinda like being out in the middle of the open and doing this. Um kind of keeps you on your toes but it works see I got 160 bullets if anything I'll end up having to clean this gun which I'll have to fly, find a place to do that in guess I could turn on the lights. I wonder what this... I, I've never thought about that. I wonder what this place looks, uh, looks like all lit up at night. Uh, okay. Run, run and gun. Run and gun. We got this. Whew. 
<laughs> oh my gosh, I thought for sure I was gonna die tonight. I, I know it ain't over with yet. It ain't over with yet. We still, it's still, still early yet. Well, not early, but much closer to morning. I see this right here. This gonna get you in trouble. See that? That bitch was hauling ass. Oh shit! Run, run and gun. I think they're going faster than me. I really do. Come on, give me my book. God, she took that head on. Did you see that shit? Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. We getting our asses whipped. <laughs> oh God, see, I told you, that's what's gonna get me killed. Oh. And these guys spawn so quick inside of here. They really do. If you try to go through this building by yourself, they'll spawn. You, you can clear all these guys out down here and they will respawn before you even get... Before you even get done. Oh, there's one behind you. See, I, see, this is what I call the chicken run method, you know? You have your quick getaway over yonder. Of course, you wait too late and they're hot on your ass, you're screwed. I'm just messing around till morning so we can see how many zombies we've killed. Ah! Where'd you come from? Oh crap! Running gun, running gun. I told you, man, they are hot on my rear. They are hot on my rear end. Oh my gosh, that side swiped her. That it wasn't a full hit. Oh. I hear more feet. I hear more feet. Where you at? Well, I think I'm hearing my own feet. What Flash is scared of his own feet? Oh. Nothing found. What are you kidding me? Alright, I'm going to take a bandage or two before I go any further. I'm not going to clear this out, but bandages use. At least one, anyway. Uh, let's use another one. They get. They get hot on your tail and you're screwed. Try to keep your distance. Uh, at least, at least you don't slow down when you reload. That's one thing I definitely like about this game. Uh, now, you slow down when you switch weapons. If you're running and you try to switch weapons, you will slow down. But if you're, you're running and you reload your weapon, it doesn't seem like you slow down. If you do, it's not enough for me to notice. up dude oh man you sideswipe them doesn't work as good gotta get that full blunt hit toiletry okay well we might try to hit this up next time and see what horde number four is like Oh, that was a good hit. How many zombies? How many zombies? 60. Well, that's not too bad since I did all that goofing off, right? That's not too bad at all. I wouldn't call it goofing off, but... We were trying to set up a barricade. Which we will finish. We will try it. That was, that was pretty fun. That was pretty fun. I'm telling you right now, though, I kind of like, uh, something went wrong. Okay. Something went wrong there. I didn't pick anything up. Chat's telling me to take a picture. <laughs> you could stand up here. I'm not saying this would work. You could try standing up here. It would be easy jump, and I don't think it, the fall would kill you or hurt you. Uh, but they'll come up here. They will. Some of them. 
But if you stand close enough down here, they might try to hit you from down there. I don't know. Can you be brave enough to do the chicken run method? That really wasn't that bad. It wasn't that bad at all. Alright guys, old Whiplash is going to let you all go. Um, I'm not sure what we'll do next time. Uh, I think I might try to finish that spikes off camera. And, uh, you know, maybe we'll try that next time. But I really do like the chicken run method. It's fun. It's a lot of fun. Uh, as long as you have, you got to have at least one escape route or at least one place where you can gain stamina. First rule of the chicken run method. Got to have it. If you don't, you're definitely going to die. <laughs> Alright guys, I hope y'all enjoyed the episode. If y'all did, uh, hit that like button for me guys. If y'all want to see more, subscribe to the channel. Everyone have a beautiful day, and God bless.